they were uh, carving of the shapes of the credenza. And so we'll be using the carving. Now, of course, you always have to have your safety equipment. You always have to be very, very safe. Um, you have to put it on the correct order, of course. You have to have a safety jacket. And you have to have uh, safety gloves. Safety is very important. You always see on these videos, you must be safe. Okay? And uh, so we're going to be safe. safety stuff I can't uh, can't work that way so anyway all right now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get the camera to zoom in I'm gonna show I already started carving okay so uh, bear with me I don't know if you can see me but uh, you can hear me I guess as you can see I did all the patterns all traced out and what I do is I go along the edge here, and you just uh, know how you can see that. But you go, and you tr you follow your line. You want to get that started first. You always want to make sure you're not going to splinter the wood out. And you just scrape. And there's many different tools for many different shapings. Um, everybody has their favorite tools on how they do it. Uh, this is how I like to do it. Um, I don't have any formal training or schooling. So I'm sure there's somebody out there saying that I'm doing it wrong. But that's the way I do it. And you have a tool like this, it's curved, smaller curves for if you, when you're getting up in, up in this area here. And then even again a tighter curve for like an area like here. And of course you have uh, many other tools, tools, straight edge and all that, depending on what you need to do. So um, what I'm going to do is just going to continue on. And as you can see i got a lot of work to do. Uh, but when it's done, hopefully this thing will look uh, pretty cool, a lot of work involved, and uh, just keep on going on. I'll do. I'll show you a little bit more, and then uh, what I'll do is I'll come back later, and when this one's all done, and I'll show you the next step. Now, I don't usually do like I'm doing it like this, so you can see exactly what I'm doing. So I did it over here. This is my favorite hand. That's what I like to use. Okay. Of course, the most important is having really good tools. Um, I just got these. These are really good. They're really, um, they flex and they have a great shape to them. And uh, they, stay, they stay sharp for a long time. All right, so uh, I'll be back in a little bit, show you this one done. And to see you come in. Oh, okay. Um, well, I'm I'm sitting out some of this area here. You can see that uh, I got it all carved out. And what I'm going to show you next is what the wood grain is actually going to look like.
so you can see. Just up. And then you can see right there what it's going to look like the wood grain. Some really great grain there. And of course, you can see these lines here. That's where, that's where they're going to get cut, and they'll be individual doors. So there you go. Some really cool grain. You see some grains here, some grains here. Look really look sharp. And uh, okay, well, I'll tell you one thing. My hand is killing me. I think I've had enough for today. So uh, I'll see you next time. Don't sneak up on me like, like that. <laughs> that scared me. Alright, see you later.